and the other one today we have another song which is about parts of speech for unit 9 environment let's start by start by reviewing adverb of frequency you have always you know something that you do every day usually you do it uh, from uh, not to the degree of always but it is under always for 80 percent often something that you do regularly but often not not usually and not always it is often sometimes sometimes from time to time you do something so you uh, use sometimes but with never you never do it never use it or never uh, do something so you use never here we have some uh, uh, vocabulary related to seasons and uh, the weather uh, you have spring summer autumn and winter so the four seasons uh, let's try to uh, to match the season with the, the months listen and repeat then match the more the months with the season you have spring summer march june winter autumn september november may january february july april december august and october you can take uh, two minutes to put the months on the right uh, column here are the vocabulary organized within categories for example june july august march april may september october november december january and february you can match those months with the seasons take uh, some time to think about them then try to see to copy the answers on the screen with the answers that you have already done in your notebooks for example we have spring is uh, matches march april and may summer june july and august winter december january and february autumn september october and november now let's return back to uh, parts of speech try to answer the question what is the meaning of the following parts of speech we have a noun a verb pronoun and adjective and we have in the category b an action is a word that is used instead of a noun a word that describes a noun can be a person a place animal or a thing uh, take one minute to think about the definitions or the the meanings that uh, stand for the other words here are the answers a noun can be a person a place an animal or a thing a verb can stand for an action pronoun is a word that is used instead of a noun you use the, verb, the, the pronoun to replace the noun an adjective a word that describes a noun for example an adjective a good man or a nice uh, girl a good student a tall a tall person a small small uh, for example uh, book a pronoun i i is a pronoun you he pronoun for example verb you know speak uh, talk uh, drink listen all the verbs that you know a noun for example school is a noun table is a noun computer is a noun laptop is a noun pen and so on try to give us examples for nouns 
verbs and adjectives or pronouns. Some examples that you know. For example, here are school, house, dog, James, or not. A verb, for example, speak, listen, talk, or go. Adjective, small, tall, big, hard, and nice. Pronoun, I, he, she, it, they. Here is a sentence which is, I like sunny weather. You need to identify the parts of speech. For example, what is I? And what is like? What is sunny? And what is weather? Uh, so, the first one is I is a pronoun. Like is a verb. Sunny is an adjective. Weather is a noun. Yes. Let's move to practice. Uh, what kind of word is underlined? Here are uh, some sentences in which you need to. Uh, the, uh, identify the words that is underlined that is written in the, uh, the green the red the red color take uh, five minutes to think about uh, the answers and or write them your answers on the uh, your notebook and pause the video in order to uh, check and compare your answers with answers on the screen later on uh, here, here is the correction. First one, the teacher's shoes are red. So it is. And now, I always walk to school. It is a verb. The cat sleeps all day. A noun, cat. He had a green bar. Green, which is a an adjective because the adjective describes the ball. Green ball. Grandmother makes couscous. It is a verb. A verb it is about action. The baby drinks milk. Drinks milk. So it is an action. It is a verb. The one, it's an apple. Apple is a noun. She looked for the yellow book. A book which is yellow. So it is an adjective. 